What's going on YouTube, it's Mookie here. Welcome back to the channel. We got some good content today with Bradley Martin, big swole guy. Never seen him, but I can't wait to meet him. He's got a really dope facility. While mine's being built, he invited me over, so I'm uh, looking forward to it. So stay tuned for some good content. Whoa! Who knew I would make it this far? They hated, they never believed me. Yeah, I would never drop the ball. I know I make it look easy, yeah. I would expect both of us to learn a little bit about each other's space. I mean, you know, he's in the bodybuilding and get swole, lift people up phase, which I don't know that I want to do, but it's neat to learn about it. And uh, maybe he can learn about uh, baseball players. Uh, what was your first impression of Brad's content? It was uh, crazy. Like, it was super cool, but just to know that someone can just lift up people and move people and move really anything in front of them, no matter how heavy, light, whatever it is, <laughs> it's definitely shocking for sure so i want to ask him like how did that even come about like did you just tell people to just get on a bar and i'm just gonna lift you up i mean how many times did he fail before he did that you know How you doing, brother? Bradley. Nice, nice to meet, meet you, man. sir. Yo, so how do you normally train? Yeah, that's a great question. I got a trainer, okay. obviously. So I really kind of let him do it. But well, before I you had a trainer. I before I had a trainer, I used to I used to try and get swole. Like I was young, and like I'm thinking lift as much weight as possible because yeah. that's gonna equate to performance. As I got a little bit older, it for me it doesn't equate to performance. I mean, it doesn't. There's no specific lifts that you notice equate to performance. I'm sure there is, but off the top of my head, not really. For me, someone like I'm small, right? So I'm not gonna all of a sudden start hitting 450 foot home runs. You know, my my home runs go 402. As long as they go. As long as they it go. Doesn't matter. Matter. Yeah. You gonna take me to your workout? Like, yeah, let's do my workout because okay. I ain't gonna be able to keep okay. up with you. All right. <laughs> I'm starting to bat. So when you decided to get swole, what was your theory behind all that? Like why To get you, swole? Yeah, like where, where you already swole? I didn't really decide to get swole. I think it, it like chose me because oh, really? my childhood had, had a lot to do with why I fell in love with the gym because the gym just became a place where I was like, I felt like I was escaping like the rest of my life. Okay. So then I got swole because of that. Not so okay. much like, oh, I, I want to get big. I was playing sports, but I realized I just like working out more than I like playing sports. Mm. There's very few of you because I don't enjoy working I out love that it. much. I'm addicted <laughs> I, to it. I do it because I have to. Wait, we're doing this? Yeah. I thought we were doing back? No, no see, this is the moving part. Oh my God. You gotta be able to okay. move. This is a, I feel a little bamboozled here. I didn't know we were doing this. No, this All is right. the start though. <laughs> okay. See, this is part where, why when I get on the field and I can just kind of do whatever or whatever sport, I can play them all because I can just move efficiently. And I can just rely on my athletic ability to kind of take me and do everything I need to do. So it's almost like you're a cheater. I'm I wouldn't call it that, but yeah. You're just naturally talented. Yeah. Oh, it's easy. This is the beginning though. The amount of weights I would have to lift for it to change my performance, I don't have time to do. I never train like this, ever. You're moving just fine. Yeah, yeah. So maybe I got good hips. I got good hips. So what is this one? For, oh, just go forward. forward. Okay. You're alternating. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. You're what's gonna the, feel good. You what's feel the point of this? <laughs> so you can move. I feel like I'm doing ballet or something. <laughs> I actually probably needed that. My hips are tight. <laughs> yeah. Then when you go do this deadlift, you're like, ah. Oh. Feel better. It feels, no, I do feel warmed up. Is this enough weights for you? Yeah. Well, you rather just put it on your back? Yeah. Or just, you know, pick a See, girl and just throw it. her. Yeah. I wonder if I could do a single leg. That's kind of embarrassing that he's doing single leg or he can do it on his toes. That was like a good weight for me. And that was way too light for you. That's okay. But you, you're, you know, you're lighter. Yeah, I'm tiny. I'm How much you weigh? weigh? On a good day, like 173. How much does like, that affect baseball? Eating or weight? Weight. A lot. Because I always notice like some baseball players are just bigger. Like they look typically more out of shape. Not that they need to be in crazy shape. I think weight plays a big part because it just equates to more, like, more mass. And like hitting a ball is mass times velocity. Yeah. Right? No, but obviously knowing how to hit it right. is the key. That's, that's the part that I, I just know how to hit it. And so that's why I can be a smaller guy and still hit. Yeah. But other people like Aaron Judge, Stanton. Yeah. 
people that are huge, Otani, people that are big like that, that speed off the bat, the harder you can hit the ball, obviously, the better. Yeah. That's the thing that I never understand. Golfing and baseball, like how you hit a ball in a certain angle or does so much difference. I don't understand that. No, it's <laughs> yeah. huge. Like you, you're already, you're a big guy, right? So you're only, the only thing was, can you swing fast enough? Right. If you can swing fast enough. And also the angle, right? Like, I mean, part of it, but I mean, if you swing fast enough, like for you, it doesn't matter as much. For me, the angle matters more. I see. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm small, I can't generate as much speed and yeah. power, you know? You're, so you're doing cheating jumps. Cheating jumps. Okay, I like that. Cheating jumps, it all is a part of being athletic. I think after this workout, I think I probably hit a baseball farther than you. I'm gonna go, hell no. Hell <laughs> no. no. Damn. He's <laughs> with the fuck? <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> okay. That's weird. It's super weird. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> See, that's all part of it. Shit I've never done before. That's what today's called. <laughs> Funny, I never warm up ever. This is so new to me. Do I need to hold the machine so it doesn't move? Imagine. Pretty cool. Did, it, did your back like pop? No. Yeah, my back pops when I do that. How old are you? 31. Because you're younger than me, that's why. <laughs> I feel like these are like ways to improve your sex game. Okay. Like, these are like hit It helps. It helps. Crazy. Dude, I want to ask him about sports. Oh my God, what the heck? Yo, wait a sec. That's not a toy. Hey, wait a sec. That's not a toy. Catch, and as you catch it, let it take you into the loading of the hip. And then you explode out of it. Okay. Heads up, guys. Hey, yeah, look out there. I don't know which way this shit's going. Oops, my bad. Sorry. So that's just the difference, like, I have to use my hips. Yeah. I weigh 170 pounds. So when you're hitting, you have to. I have to use everything I got. It's gotta be efficient. And that's amazing that's what you've been able to do. Because I do a sex movement. There you go. God bless me too. So what is your bench now? Now it's probably like six. Like four women. Yeah, like four women, about four women. Total on the bar. Yeah, with some, maybe they had a little extra water weight that day. Cause they, you know, ate some candy or something. Oh, yeah, this has done. to be the first time this is, we're done. I've ever warmed up. No, this is, this is, the, well, I'm done. I haven't I mean, ended. So what are we, what are we, we'll be benching right now? What's going on here? I don't do any of that. None of that. Let's deadlift. See, then I got, I got to play in the game. One game. Uh, <laughs> one kidding. game today. I'm oh, kidding. When you're not on season, do you do more strength training specific yes, stuff? Okay. Yes, yes, yes. That makes sense. Off season is when I do all that. But during the season, it's like. I like this, though. Yeah. I this should probably one. do more of this before I actually work out. See? My hips are open, like they feel more activated. We made him a believer. No, it's true, I believe we it. made him a believer. I honestly like, but we should like really train though. Okay, in the off season, <laughs> when I don't mind being sore for okay. two weeks. Deal? Deal. Okay, Deal. it won't be that crazy. Two okay. girls, easy. Just on each, just one on each side? One on each side. One on each side, Can, well, they're gonna weigh about what? I don't know. 90 to 100 uh, one, one, 110. We'll do like walking lunges with him, each side. 110. Okay. Easy. Stay tuned for that video. We gotta do more stuff together for sure. Yeah, it's good to see another perspective. Completely, Bro, genuinely completely different. Genuinely appreciate it. I really yeah, appreciate the warm up. <laughs> no, <laughs> I didn't mean it. Go, no, I know. You know I, I, I love it. Yeah. Like, I feel good mentally, too. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. We got him. You did. You got him. Yeah, let's get a photo. I never do that kind of stuff. I feel good. Honestly, I think I can hit a baseball super far right now. We'll work out and then we'll go hit. Okay. I'll take you to Dodger Stadium. There you go. I'll yeah. take you to Dodger Stadium. We can hit on the field. By Dude, that I'm going to smack one. If I get a home run, so someone got it. He got to pay me. You got to pay me. You already bet me. You got to pay me a thousand. Okay. Cool. If you can hit one out. That we got a workout. Yes, sir. And then BP. I'll be ready. All right. Make thank sure you for you coming, are. man. Yes, sir. Thank you. All right, guys, that was a super dope workout. I think Brad liked it. All the warm up for him, which was the actual workout for me, but it is what it is. So we'll be looking forward to that video later when he's hitting home runs in Dodger Stadium and I'm lifting women somehow. We'll, we'll see where we go with that. But anyways, make sure you guys like and subscribe and I'll see you guys soon.